Thank you. Michael, Dirk, many congratulations into the quarterfinals of the World Cup. A fairly comfortable performance, I'd say, overall. Well, I think we, overall we can't complain. When you win 2-0 against Singapore, I think it's a good performance. Of course, there's always things where you can be critical towards yourself. But overall, you need to make and get the most confidence out of it and be happy with uh, how, how you won. It doesn't matter if it's a bad game. And at least we won, and that's really important. For you, Dirk, what was it like? Was there nerves playing your first singles game in the World Cup in a, in a Holland shirt? Well, not, not for that, but it was just... Could have been easier, and then you, you know, it's only first to four, and I missed the seventy-two. Like after after that, I put it down on a double, it's hundred plus finish, and then you just think uh, you're making it yourself harder than you should do. And eventually, I won it, so no complaining there. Michael, we saw you on the camera backstage. You looked cool, calm all the way through, fully confident that Dirk was going to get the job done. Yeah, of course, but you have to be comfortable with your partner, otherwise you can't be a great team. And uh, I think he did uh, okay in some patches. Of course, some patches he didn't do so well, but same as myself. And he, but you still have to be positive. You won the game 2 0, and that's the most important thing. And for you, Dirk, what's Michael like to have as a captain? <laughs> well, I was a bit uh, frustrated that, it, that we didn't discuss who was starting uh, first this game. Um, <laughs> So he went behind my back to say he was going first, but... <laughs> um, Michael, we saw from your Instagram as well, a bit of a frustrating night with the fire alarm at the hotel. Was that a distraction or was it not too bad? Of course, it's always a distraction, but uh, I've been on my holiday before in Gran Canaria and uh, there was a fire alarm that goes off and I was with my kids over there and actually uh, there was a fire, so I couldn't even see uh, the door opposite my room. So. Yeah, I always take things like that quite serious, and uh, yeah, you never know what happens. And especially with kids around, you have to uh, deal with it. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's it's not nice. But what can you do? I slept well. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> <laughs> we saw from your Sky interview as well. Who's winning the PlayStation battles? Oh, we we team up. We don't go to, against each other. Team building. He, he loves to team up with me anyway. You know, guys know that. <laughs> You today, mate. <laughs> Scotland up next. Tough looking game against two players that have played fairly decent tonight. Yeah, did they play decent? I think they were struggling as well. So it's going to be open game tomorrow. And uh, I think if you're going to look through all the facts, I think we're going to be favourite tomorrow. But we still have to deal with it and uh, to deal with it in a positive way. Uh, we know what we're capable of and we know what we're able to do. And I'm looking forward to tomorrow's game, actually. Gentlemen, thank you very much as always and all the best tomorrow. Okay. Cheers. Thank you.